Hello everyone. Welcome to Gautam Digital Learning. My name is Srinivas. I am the faculty in Solution Architect for ServiceNow. In today's session, we are going to learn form layout. Before we start today's session, first of all, let us talk about what is form layout and form design. In the last episode, we discussed about form design, right? In that episode, we learned about form design. How can we design the form through form design? In today's session, we are going to learn how can we change the layout of the form. Let's get started. Let me show you how can we design the form through form layout. Navigate to incident application or a table. Click on create new. It can open a new form. When you want to change the layout of the form, just you can go to the form layout. Right click on form header. Go to configure. This configuration UI action can visible to only service no administrator. That means only service no administrator can configure the form layout and design the form. Go to the form layout. Go to configure and form layout. Okay, so this is called a slash bucket. Here we have two boxes. Left side box, you can see all available fields. Right side box, you can see all selected fields. When you want to add any field, Randomly, we can choose the field and just click on add. I have successfully add a field to incident form. If you want to show this field under transfer reason, just you can select the field and uh, move up, move up, move up should be show under transfer reason. Click on save. Now you can see the duration is showing under transfer reason and similarly, if you want to remove any field from your form, go to the form header, navigate to configure, click on form layout. When you want to remove any field from your form, just you can select the field and click on remove or else just you can double click. The field can remove from the form and add it to available and save it. So what is the main difference between form layout and form design? Form layout is the old component to design the form form design is the new component to design the form but both are used to design the form depends on your flexibility you can use that may be form layout or form design and next one can we create any custom field through form layout yes we can create custom field through form layout also right click on form header go to configure and the form layout if you make any changes through form layout Changes can replicate to directly your form, right? But uh, when you made any changes through form design, you have to reload the browser until and unless changes cannot replicate. Okay, go to the form layout. And now let me show you how do we create custom field in service no incident form. For example, let me create a field called gender. So this is all about uh, data types. Which data type we have to choose create choices so select choice what about remaining guys depends on your client requirement we have to choose respective field in your form in this case let me choose the choice and click on add and the field gender should be under transfer region if you want to remove the transfer region double click double click is for the universal request also and save it so once we save the changes through form layout Changes can replicate directly to your form. No need to reload the any browser, not required. Now you can see gender field. I have successfully created a new field called gender. So after that, how can we create choices for your choice field? It's a very simple to create new choices. Go to the gender, right click on the label, go to configure choices. What are the choices you want to create for this field? You can create over here. First one is male and the second one is female. Add and save it. See, now you can see your choices over here in general field. Next one. What is the difference between predefined field and a custom field? So where we can check the details guys? Go to any field, it may be predefined field. Right click on the label, 
and click on show contact type it's a field name right so the field is coming from which table what is the internal name of the field and this is data type maximum length of the characters and so when you create a custom field the name will starts with u underscore that u underscore can determine its a custom field but when you open any predefined field you can't see any u underscore that means this is not custom field so let me open custom field properties right click on the label go to show gender right so the internal name of the field is u underscore gender so when you create any custom field the name will starts with u underscore this u underscore can determine it's a custom field and next one can we delete the field from your form yes we can delete the field permanently how can we delete custom field permanently right click on the label go to configure dictionary how can we delete the field so click on delete column so click on delete column you will get confirmation box do you want to delete this column yes i want to delete this column click on okay the field has been successfully deleted from incident form if you delete any field unfortunately can we recover it no the field has deleted permanently next one can we delete predefined field now let me show you guys right click on channel field go to configure dictionary can we delete predefined field in service now no we can't delete any predefined field in service now there is option to delete not available right that means system not allow to delete the field permanently because this is called custom like predefined field okay next one how do we create a section so when you open any form it is following the same infrastructure okay so this is called main section remaining sections are displaying in tabbed format like notes related records and resolution information if you want to create one more section yes we can create one more section to form layout also go to form header navigate to configure and form layout how do we create new section go to the section and click on new provide the name of section it should be unique the name of section is more info section has been successfully created after the creation of the section how can we add the field now let me add some fields randomly to the section depends on your client requirement we have to add the fields to your section and save it yes i have successfully created a section in my incident form so can we replace the section this section i want show at second place how can you replace this section right click on form header go to configure and click on form layout how can you replace the section select your section and uh, move up move up it will show and after related records or notes right depends on your client requirement you can choose the place and save it out now you can see this more information section over here next one how can we delete this section through form layout let me try to delete configure and form layout there is no option to delete the section through form layout there is option we called delete it from form layout then how can you delete the section so only the way to delete the section through form design how can we delete the section through form layout right click on form header go to configure click on form design form design so how can we delete the section which section do you want to delete you can delete the section and the save and back to ui just you can reload the form or the browser changes can replicate automatically the section has been successfully created this is about how can we design the form through form layout in last episode we discussed about how can we design the form through form design both are same the main difference is so when you made any changes when you make any changes in your form so until and unless you load the browser changes can't replicate but here when you make any changes through form layout so just you can save it out then automatically changes can replicate to the 
form layout. So this is the difference between a design and form layout. And one more thing also, we can't delete any section through form layout. Only the way to delete the section through form design. This is about form design and form layout. Depends on your client requirement. You can use any component. Thanks for your time. Have a great day.